Game one of the East rolls on. Game two, just about ready to tip off. Playoff basketball on 2K Sports. With David Aldridge on our sideline, and here with me, Greg Anthony and Steve Smith, this is Kevin Harlow. We'll see Pittsburgh and the Toronto Raptors. Taking a look at Toronto. A successful outing in game one has them right where they want to be with a chance here, guys, to take game two on their home court. And this is the game that gives them a chance to put the hammer down. I mean, if they can build on their game one win with another one tonight, they'll have a stranglehold on this series. Let's check out Pittsburgh's starting lineup. We've got Zizic. Morris is out there with Hunter. And it's Forbes in at the two. Lowry passes to Leonard. Over Morris, and it's Leonard. That time on the assist by Leonard. Right there, that is poise of Kawhi Leonard just taking what the defense gives him. Zizic kicks to Morris. Back to Zizic. Six to shoot. And that one, good. And how about the awareness? Hunter possesses, understands when one of his guys has an opportunity. From 11 feet away, misses off the left iron. Here's Pittsburgh with the ball. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Thank you, Kevin. Well, Pittsburgh's head coach and I were able to chat. We spoke about his approach coming into tonight. He said, we're playing an excellent team with lots of talent, and they're well coached. They don't want to go down 2-0 in the series, so our mindset is this is a must-win game. Kevin, we'll see if they can pull that off after the disappointing start to this series. Thanks so much, David. Morris, no good. Yeah, they had some botched coverage that turned into no coverage. Here's Lowry. He's now one for two with that bucket. When you are Lowry's size, you need to have a strong floater, and that was a beauty he just put up. They could use a big shot here to get this offense going. Too many empty possessions right now. They need a basket. Here's Zizic. Four. Connects from three-point range. And they don't want to get in a habit of giving him open looks from three. First quarter still, but not who you want to leave open. Here's Poole. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot at him. I mean, beautiful execution of the game plan offensively. So far, they are hitting 80% from the field. Now, here is Morris. Hunter, the pass to Zizic. Hunter with it. Leonard's there. Pass to Zizic. Pittsburgh working the ball around. And here's Morris for three. It's rebounded by Leonard. Raptors leading by three. From outside the arc, and Kyle Lowry with the three. Lowry's got his second bucket of the night. This is as good as it gets for a first quarter in terms of shooting the basketball. Morris against Leonard. Hunter kicks to Morris. Over Siakam. Morris, no good. Wow, that's one you just kind of assume is going in. Tough luck. Oh, and they get in the way of the alley-oop. Not to be. Good play defensively. Two minutes. Forbes the pass to Morris. Now Hunter. Pass to Forbes. But Trey, a three-pointer is right on target. Forbes has got a pair of threes now in the first quarter for Pittsburgh. And so it's Leonard with it. He'll bring it up for the Toronto Raptors. Three-point lead. And there's the pass to Siakam. And so it's going to be a three-second violation out there on the defense. The Raptors shooting their first free throw of the night. NBA champion, finals MVP, Kawhi has done a lot in a short time. O'Neal's checked in for Pittsburgh. DeAndre Bembry comes in for Brent Forbes. Now here's Leonard. Buries it from about 10 feet away. Leonard's got five points so far. Just such a well-rounded offensive player. He's got a little bit of everything. Morris kicks to Bembry. Inside. O'Neal misses. 
That was excellent contest, preventing him from making something that's usually automatic. Here's Leonard, and the Raptors check on two more. But how about that move? You'll see very few players able to pull off. Just sensational stuff. Morris passes to O'Neal. 44 seconds left to play in the first quarter. Here's Morris. The shot will not fall. And Toronto will go the other way with it. Well, he's put up zeros for an entire quarter. Not the way you try to get back into this ball game. And what a way to start this game, dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared, focused, and really jumped on the other team early. Here's Bembry. He's been quiet so far. Still no points in the game. Pittsburgh needs to get off a shot here. And he can't stop the run as he misses. Kawhi Leonard has been on display for the Toronto Raptors. He finishes with nine points in the quarter. The D is having all sorts of problems with them. And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way after this break. And glad to have you with us as we get going here in game two. What do you guys think about the Raptors here in this one? Stingy on the defensive end in that first quarter. They were just getting up into people. Yeah, they were very physical and very aggressive. They've just been the better team so far. Here's Van Vliet. Ten-point lead. This is their biggest. And Pittsburgh looking at who they've got out there. They've got Morris. Hunter is out there with Wagner. Then it's O'Neal. And it's Bembry in at the shooting guard. Here's Morris. Makes that one after missing his first six shot attempts. One for seven and hungry for more. Love the recognition. Realizes that one is all him. Sometimes that's the call. You want to be unselfish, but even more so, you want to be effective. Such a wide open look. Middleton's got the lead up to 10 now for the Raptors. Passes to Hunter. Here's the lob to the hoop. Oh, a nice defensive play to disrupt the alley-oop. Here's Poole, and he goes in for the dunk. He takes advantage of them in every way possible. And Greg lures them into a trap on the steal, and then bang, right to the bucket. Great activity at both ends. Great teamwork as well. Uh, with a number of moves and shots to choose from, Hunter is scary. Nice bucket there. Van Vliet passes to Gasol. Count the basket. Gasol's got his first points in this one. Of the two offenses here tonight, you can tell theirs is just a bit more in sync. They've had better patience, better shot selection so far, but we still have a long way to go. Toronto leading by 12. Two minutes now played in the second quarter. And Wagner pulls it down. That's going to be over a batch. Not watching for the line that time. And it's easy to give up after a play like that. But this team needs to keep fighting. It's just one trip down the court. But you have to have short memory in this league or you won't last long. Here's Poole. Second chance shot. Fouled on the shot and picks up two points. So one free throw coming up. He's not looking at the score. He's staying focused, and he's staying active. There's two things they rely on him for, being competitive and bringing energy. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Quarter two and just under two and a half minutes gone by. Here's Trier. Kicks to Forbes. 
five on the clock. Out left to the wing. Fires from deep. It's not going to go for him. And it's the Raptors taking it the other way. Here's Poole. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. And this is his second trip to the line tonight. At the line for the Raptors. First free throw is good. He hits both from the strike. He's in attack mode, drawing contact now, getting to the line, something he didn't do at all in the first quarter. And it'll be Pittsburgh with their first time out of the game here. And Coach can't like what he's seeing, trying to get them refocused. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. of action so far in the second quarter. Pittsburgh working the ball around. Pass to Trier. Pocket six. They need this. Here's Wagner. And he battles for the ball and gets the second chance bucket. Wagner's got his first points of the game. Really nice job to convert the putback opportunity there. I mean, he stayed with that play from start to finish. That's something we say about him a lot. Middleton can't get it to go. Pittsburgh trails by 15. Guys, they're looking for a way to score here. Yeah, they've had a tough time taking the lid off. Smile a geach. His second shot goes in. Off to a good start, two for two. A beautiful bounce pass on the deck. He put it only where his man could get it. Now here's Van Vliet. He's gotten some minutes, but nothing on the board yet. And the pressure he put on that shot forced the miscue. The rim protection at its finest. The result is the same whether you block the shot or simply change it. Trier in the corner. There's the three. Rebound by the Raptors. Big win for them coming off a strong game on Friday. Tremendous poise on the offensive end. Overall, they did not settle for bad shots. They were very patient, and that was the difference. It's hard to be patient, I know, but look at the outcome they had. Here's Trier after Toronto picking up the basket just moments ago. Pass to Forbes. In the corner, O'Neal with it. The pass to Forbes. Oh, good with the triple. He's cooled down a little bit after draining those two three-pointers in the first quarter. Cool, no good. There is the value of great rim protection without fouling, forcing the miss. And the shot goes down. And defensively, they are on their heels every time the ball comes inside. Here's Poole. He's got nine. Trying to get open as a bucket. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting free throws here. The Raptors shooting their fifth and sixth free throws of the game. Shooting for Toronto. Two shots.
He's off on the first. Some changes for Toronto. Siakam is checked in for Ibaka. And Kyle Lowry subbed in for Fred Van Vliet. Good on the second free throw. We've got 22 seconds left in the second quarter. Here is Forbes, now recovering. Forbes, the pass to Zizic. Richardson outside. With one on the clock. Marcus saw working so hard on defense, making sure he gets himself in the airspace of shooters. The clock runs out, and we're heading to halftime. The Raptors out in front, leading by 14. We'll see you back here after the break for third quarter basketball. The 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again. Welcome to our postseason halftime show. Ernie Johnson along with the Diesel and the Jet. For the Raptors, they're in a perfect position to grab a hold of this series. Up 1-0 already and playing incredible basketball, which has given them a huge lead at halftime. Uh, they just couldn't have asked for a better scenario. And taking a look at the Raptors, Kenny, what did you see out there? Well, it comes down to confidence. From the opening tip, these guys had that swag. They had the attitude that you can't beat us, we can only beat ourselves. Shaq, let's get your insight on the visiting team. Well, it's no wonder they're getting blown out. No energy, no fight in the rebound battle. Ernie, you got to pick it up. You got to pick it up starting now, or it's going to be impossible to come back. Like the Pythagorean theorem, times 50, times 100, times 50, times 10. Impossible to figure out, Ernie. And now with the second half about to get underway, let's send you back courtside. See everybody with Kevin Harlan. Well, it doesn't get much better than playoff basketball. Let's get back to the action here in round one. Toronto leading by 14. Siakam and Ibaka, the duo down low. Then there's Lowry. Then there's Kawhi Leonard. And it's Poole in a two-go. So that's the five in the game for Toronto. We'll get the analytics. This is one of Lowry's favorite areas to operate from. Morris dishes to Hunter. Passes it to Forbes. Morris with the ball. Five to shoot. Over Siakam. Morris, no good. And they've got a big lead, not just on the scoreboard, but really in the rebounding numbers as well. 14 feet away. And Lowry gets it to go. Lowry's got four points in the quarter. He's given a great lift to this offense tonight. Very, very efficient. Here is Forbes. Now recovering. Leonard with the steal. Here's Poole. And foul on the shot. So he'll get a chance at the line. The Raptors shooting their seventh and eighth free throw attempts for the game right here. And he makes the first. Both shots good from the strike. Pittsburgh trails by 20. Morris looking over the floor and out of bounds as the Raptors gain possession. Boy, if you're the coach, you hate to see that kind of miscommunication between your guys. First minute and a half of basketball here in the third quarter. Loads it up there for Siakam. Throws down the alley slam. 
Boy, you have to be impressed with the offensive production. They have got it firing on all cylinders. It's been tremendous job of play calling and execution. They just continue to increase this lead. Now a timeout called by Pittsburgh. Trying to find some answers offensively. Yeah, these guys need to work together as a team, as a unit. Try and carve out some easy buckets. Checked in. Here's Hunter. Pass to Zizic. Smile again. Covered by Siakam. Shot clock at six. Smile again. And nothing is falling for him right now. Plus eight in the rebound differential. One more reason why they're in control. They get it back. Here's Siakam, and they convert it last on a tip number three. You know, before coaches started running plays for him, this is where Siakam would get his points on the offensive glass. Now, here's Hunter. He's covered by Leonard. And so it looks like Pittsburgh will retain possession here. A touch over two and a half minutes of basketball played here in the third quarter. Three on the clock. Smile again. And they start the second half with three straight misses. And again, it's Pittsburgh missing. Poole, the pass to Leonard. And it's off from three-point range. They need a good offensive possession. Yeah, they've gone a long time without a bucket. That one falls. Eight points for him. And with those points, he puts it into that 10-0 run by the Raptors. Lowry finds Leonard. Ibaka outside. A three-pointer, no good. It's so hard to keep the defense honest when you miss wide open looks like that. Here's Zizic. He's still scoreless so far in this one. Is Bembry offline with his three. Raptors leading by 22. To the inside. Ibaka. Kawhi is carving up this defense. Love his awareness. He is finding the open man. And here is Morris. Pass to Hunter. Here's Bembry. Morris outside from deep three-point range. Pittsburgh gets it back with a new 14. And count it. The shot is good. He'll go to the free throw line. Yeah, exceptional play there to take the bump and still get it to fall. Pittsburgh shooting their first foul shot of the night. Richardson, he's checked in for Pittsburgh. We've got 128 left in the third. Lowry for three. Pittsburgh pulls it in. Richardson outside. And the pass to Bembry. Here's Zizic. Bembry kicks to Morris. Clock at four. And stolen by Siakam. Outside Lowry. Passes it to Leonard. Fades away. The shot's good on the assist by Lowry. 
Lowry's got three assists tonight. A good find by Kyle Lowry. Doesn't always get enough credit for his vision. Pass to Zizic. Now the dish to Hunter. A three-pointer off the mark. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. And the official signal the backcourt violation. Not very careful there. Yeah, but just the second turnover of the game. I mean, overall, pretty meticulous offensively. 15 seconds left here in the third quarter. So the wing on the left. He kicks it to Richardson. One second left, and the last shot at the buzzer doesn't go in for it. And so it's Toronto riding high with a 23-point lead heading into the break. From the field, they have been outstanding, amazing shooting. That's what has them headed to a blowout. Back to the action after this word. How about a look at today's State Farm assist of the game? And how about the floor generalship right here? I mean, showing us why they're always in good hands when he's the man in charge. So many good point guards in this league. So much responsibility comes with that position. That was a smart, smart play. NBA playoffs, round one. Thanks for joining us as we get back to the action on the court. And Pittsburgh, looking at who they've got out there. They've got O'Neal. Wagner out there with Hunter. Then there's Richardson, and it's Forbes in at the one. Raptors leading by 23. Lowry passes to Siakam. And Wagner pulls it down. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. Wasted no time on that one. O'Neal's got the fourth quarter going with the first basket of the period here for Pittsburgh. Feeling it out a bit. Pass to Gasol. Over Wagner. And there's Gasol. That's good on the assist by Lowry. Lowry's got four assists in the game. Capable of making shots. Mark Gasol able to do everything you want at that center position. Now here's Richardson. Now O'Neal. Forbes the pass to Richardson. Down to five on the shot clock. From downtown, and again, it's Pittsburgh with a three. Aside from the rim runners in this league, most bigs are now asked to help stretch the floor. Bounce pass from Lowry. And it's Leonard missing. Very surprising. He gets the ball where he wants it in a decent matchup. To the middle. It's tipped and stolen by Siakam. Here's Middleton. The fast break ends at the rim with the jam. You know, it's not just the energy Siakam brings to the defensive end. It's the instincts. Great job turning them over. Leonard against Richardson. Just five on the clock. From deep. Toronto grabs the miss. The biggest lead of the game was 24 points. Middleton the pass to Lowry. The pass to Leonard. That falls. Nice feed that time from Kyle Lowry. Lowry's got assist number five here tonight. Here is Forbes. Now recovering. Richardson against Leonard. They get a hand on it. Stolen by Middleton. Leonard dishes to Lowry. Back to Leonard. Uses the glass to finish the lane. Leonard's got four points now in the quarter. That makes it 10 of their last 12 coming from inside the paint. Passes it to Wagner. Lowry with the rebound. Pass to Leonard. 
The shot by Middleton, wide open. Off target from three-point range. Lowry against Richardson. He dishes it to Hunter. Six on the shot clock to stop the drought. It's rebounded by Kyle Lowry. Lowry's got five rebounds tonight. Pass to Leonard. Pittsburgh pulls it in. And guys, that's going to wrap it up. Fans are piling out the exits. Obviously a huge win here in game two for Toronto. As one-sided as it gets today, you know, there were some dominant moments in there about every facet of this game for that team. Yeah, I mean, Kevin, it's hard to think of what didn't go right for them. Uh, game planning by the coaches, execution by the players, everything was just on target. And one of the league's top talents, game in and game out. And doing it here again in this one, a terrific night for Leonard. Throughout the night, he was their catalyst at the offensive end. Play after play was run through him with great success. Richardson with it. Leonard picks him up. Steps back and shoots. Richardson no luck. And so it's Leonard with it. He'll bring it up for the Raptors. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 25. And Wagner pulls it down. And Pittsburgh with the possession here. Here's Forbes. His three-pointers off the mark. Guys, they can just sit on the ball here if they want to. They have earned this win. Leonard against O'Neal. Leonard with the ball. And so Toronto takes this one, but by a big margin. And this win puts them squarely in the driver's seat in the series. Up now, Greg, two zip with all the momentum on their side. I mean, in fantastic shape right now. If they can capitalize on this victory and win game three, you can just about put this series to bed. You got it. Well, that'll do it for now. You can join us during this first round of the Eastern Conference playoffs. For David Aldridge, Greg Anthony, and Steve Smith, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time.